Hello, today I want to show you another very useful plugin that allows you to generate the content without going and use ChatGPT or anything else, just inside the Figma. So the plugin name is Content Real. It's managed by Microsoft and developed by Microsoft. So if you have Microsoft account, you can sign in to get more access for different features. But the free version also enough for me. So how it's working, let's say we have a screen and we want to generate the avatar, for example, I'm going to add this frame here, then click on this under the home panel, click on avatars, and that will generate for me an avatar. So I can make it more roundish. The second thing I need to do is just to create a text frame. Let's say I want to add something like this, then I'm going to click this text tab and under this text tab, all I need to do is just generate the full name, first and last. And I already have a name. Then I'm duplicating that, add here an email, for example, just a randomly generated email, make it smaller, like this, and then click to the email. And boom, I have a random email here. The next thing we can play around is on images, and you can add here a lot of different images. For example, if you need to generate a logo somewhere here, you can click and take one of these logos, which is absolutely fine. But then, but first I need to create a frame and then I have a logo. We can play and change the logos here, different images. You can create even beauty avatar, something that they call a beauty avatar. Okay, maybe it's too much, so I'm going back. And the next thing I need to do, and I want to show you, is an icons. An icons is also a very useful thing, especially when you create your content. So we can go here, and under the icons, you'll find the fluent icons or any other packs. By clicking on that one, you'll see a lot of different icons here. You can change the size if you need it, or you can make it smaller, but all those icons are vectors, so it's not a big deal. And let's say I want this icon, I'm going to drag and drop it, then move it into the, my frame, I can change the size and use it as a icon, fully vector icon. This thing will help you to fulfill your prototype, for example, if you don't want to spend the time by finding like random names, random emails, or just simply adding like cool name goals here, you know, when you want to fulfill the placeholder. Instead, you can use something that looks more real just in a few clicks. And if you want to add more interesting stuff or you want to save your own template or like preset for a future, for example, you want to save the whole section and by one click, you want to generate this section for your future design, then all you need to do just sign in and then under the favorites and my content you'll see something that you created before and you can use it to save your time the content reel right now at this moment is a free plugin so feel free to use it all useful links as always will be in description thanks all for watching that video i hope that was at least useful for you please smash like subscribe on my channel and see you in the next one